Rippy, Rippy! What happened to my favorite Levi jeans? They've got a rip! You are an active person. As a result, you sometimes get rips or tears or holes in your favorite shirt or pants. I'm gonna show you a permanent way to fix those holes and rips using iron-on patches. Come on, let's go. Okay guys, so the first thing you have to do is heat the iron up to its highest heat setting. Ooh, yeah, it's definitely hot. The next step is to turn the garment inside out, unless you want your patch on the outside. Now, as you can clearly see, I've already patched these jeans once, and that hole patch job has held up quite well. That was probably five years ago. Okay, so the next thing you want to do is iron the area where you're going to apply the patch. Wow, these patches come in a variety of colors. But the next step is to put the patch on, and this is actually going to take two patches, shiny side down. There's the dull side. And there's the shiny side. Okay, now that I have my patches in place, shiny side down, I'm going to iron for about two minutes. Let's take a look at the patch application. Again, that was after two minutes at high heat, shiny side down, applying significant pressure. You want to put high heat and a lot of pressure on the patch. The final step will be to turn it back right side out and iron it for like 20 or 30 seconds more. All right, so let's take a look at the finished product. I'm very pleased, and I can tell you from experience, that patch job will last for years to come, extending the life of my Levi jeans. Wow, guys, and I just realized as I was pulling these jeans off, there's actually two other patches I put on these jeans five years ago, just to show you the durability. There was a hole back there by the pocket on this pair, and, the other leg also had um, a hole, which is, was patched five years ago. It's held up all these years. I hope you enjoyed my video and that you can breathe new life into a couple of your old favorite clothing items using iron-on patches. The brand I used was from Amazon. In the past, I've used Bondex iron-on patches, but after 10,000 views on my previous iron-on patch video, they still wouldn't give me any sponsorship money, so I switched sides. Remember, there's two keys when you're doing this procedure. The iron has to be very, very hot, and you have to apply pressure, and you need to put the patches sticky side down. Uh, shiny side down. Otherwise, you'll stick the patch to the bottom of your iron and you don't want to do that. Uh, the only final thing I can say is uh, I'm a little concerned because my wife was holding one of these up to my lips the other day, kind of sizing it up to see if maybe she could, you know, seal my mouth shut for a couple days. Just joking. Don't do anything like that. These are only to be used on clothing items. I hope you enjoyed my video. If you did, you can like it or subscribe right about here. Have a great day, and you're always welcome in Ron's basement.